Hello, my darling ladies. Crystal, your dating coach. Get over your ex now. This minute, today. You know, people say you should stop thinking about him. No, actually, you should start thinking about him. But think about the bad times, my darlings. All the broken promises, the broken dates, the messages he didn't reply to, the times he didn't call you. He said he would call you and you waited hours and hours and he didn't. Remember the bad times. So yes, think of him. Don't think about those good times, the wonderful memories, the first time you met. Because you know what? All relationships are wonderful in the beginning. You're getting to know each other, you know, finding out about each other, seeing what he likes, what you like. Everything is new and fresh. It's after six months or a year when you see who that person really is. And that person has hurt you. Because that's why the relationship ended. They have hurt you. They did not make you feel special anymore. Cared about, loved, adored. They are your ex. They are not part of your life anymore. I know. It's hard. You felt comfortable with that person. You thought the relationship was going to last years and years. Maybe get married one day. And it's over. And you have to move on. It hurts, but you know what hurts more? Thinking about the good times, the wonderful memories, and that person isn't there. You cannot call that person because they don't want to talk to you. You cannot see that person because they don't want to be with you anymore. So that's worse than moving on and it's acknowledging your new single life. And don't fall for that crap, my darlings, about being friends. He says, let's be friends. He doesn't want to be your friend. He doesn't want you to hate him. He doesn't want you not to like him. Why would you want to be friends with the man you loved? Why do you want to be a friend to someone who has hurt you? Because if that's not your boyfriend anymore, that means they have hurt you. If the relationship is over, that means it wasn't a happy relationship. They're your ex for a reason. So let's start by getting rid of everything they gave you. Yeah, I know it sounds diabolic, but yes, all those little stuffed animals, the jewelry, the photos, put them in a big box and hide them in the back of the closet so you don't see them anymore. You don't need memories of a relationship that doesn't exist anymore. Take them off your social network. You don't need to see photos of him at parties with his friends, having a good time. That's just going to make you miserable. That's just going to make you remember the times you were together. But the relationship is over. You must move forward. Yeah, it's not easy. But it's not easy to dwell on a relationship that doesn't exist anymore. And thinking about all those good times that will never happen again. Let's move forward, my darlings. You're single and ready to mingle and start accepting invitations. Yes, your friends are asking you out for drinks and to go out to dinner and you're refusing because I understand you feel hurt, you're sad, but you must accept these invitations. Go out and enjoy yourself. Yes, of course, there is a time of pain, a week, two weeks, of course, I'm not saying one day it's over, the next day go out and party and have a good time. No, you suffer a bit. It's normal to suffer, but not for long. Start loving yourself. Start realizing how happy you are without that person who wasn't making you feel so good, bringing you down, maybe embarrassing you, hurting you, ignoring you, treating you bad. Like I said, the calls that never came, not answering your messages anymore, not organizing anything for you two to do together. You're free now from that person who did not love you, who did not appreciate you, the wonderful, beautiful person you are. And a man will appreciate you. I guarantee it. Just because one man doesn't love you anymore, just because that man you had a relationship doesn't want to continue, doesn't mean you are not worthy of being loved and adored and finding a good man who will make you happy. 
So let's stop thinking about just the good times. Let's remember the hurt we felt. Let's remember that we are single now. We are fabulous because just because our relationship ended doesn't mean we're not fabulous. And some man will appreciate us. We get back into the social life. We start dating. We start accepting invitations. We do not continue a friendship with our ex. We do not continue to watch him on social network. We do not continue to think only about the good times. Remember how you felt that last week, those last days. You're free now. Move on. Love yourself. Do something special for Y-O-U. Ciao for now, my darling friends. Let me know in the comments below what you did to move on, to forget about your ex. Ciao for now.